There was no mention of Berkshire Hathaway in this press release. Barron's had been speculating lately that if you were to buy this, you may go to Warren Buffett and Berkshire Hathaway to ask for financing on this. They even tracked down an Occidental jet that they said landed recently in Omaha, and we're speculating from that. Uh, is Berkshire involved in this deal? Berkshire is not involved in this deal because we didn't need them to be. Uh, thankfully, Berkshire and Warren Buffett were um, helpful with the Anadarko acquisition, and we wouldn't be where we are today as a company had it not been for Warren Buffett and Berkshire. Uh, but we didn't need um, any help with this deal. Uh, we have the divestitures that we need to be able to uh, to pay down the debt that we'll raise to to uh, close on it. Berkshire Hathaway not involved in this, but they are your largest shareholder, about a 25% stake plus $8 billion in those 8% preferreds and warrants on additional shares potentially. Um, did they sign off on this deal? Did they know about it? Was Barron's right that the jet was there? Uh, Barron's was right. The jet was there. But I'm not always there to talk about uh, business. Um, we I talk about other things uh, with uh, Warren Buffett. Uh, he's uh, an amazing person to uh, to get the opportunity to speak to, and and I feel grateful and fortunate that um, that I'm able to go and and have uh, those opportunities to speak to him. Um, we what we try to do when we're making big decisions like this is we try to make sure our shareholders understand what we're doing, try to make sure that we're talking with all of our share, large shareholders um, to ensure that they know what our strategy is, and this is very consistent. With, um, with what we're trying to do with our value proposition. And so this shouldn't be uh, inconsistent to them uh, or to any of our shareholders in how we're approaching uh, delivering value over time.